<laughs> Hi, I'm Michi and that's my channel. <laughs> okay, I make the intros for the series one in a row, so you will see me wearing the same shirt. So don't mind. <laughs> so that's the second part of the series of the 2000 piece puzzles. Uh, we built three uh, and here we are in part two. Um, now is the Amy Stewart one on the row. Uh, so uh, you see me doing uh, the Amy Stewart puzzle, uh, also in chaos puzzling style. So um, I don't think I want to say more. So enjoy this time lapse and we see each other at the end. <sighs> I don't know, maybe. <laughs> so, and here are my other 2000s. So, here is the Ravensburger one, uh, the other coast. <laughs> and I don't know, I think we'll compare this to this so this is made in the year 1995 and this uh, 1999 and it's also made in France um, this is a younger one that's a 2014 made in Germany that two are made in France and this is made in, in Germany. I just don't know how to assemble this. I mean, I have an older one here and I think here we have the same pieces, the same cardboard, I think a little bit thicker than these pieces, I don't know. Let me check it out now. No, that's a, exactly the same. If you see the cardboard, mine is slightly, but no. But it's the condition of the cardboard to the year. I think originally they have the same, the same piece quality. And they also fit so seamless. So this is a really nice surface on the puzzle like the the post one but i think we we'll make a break about this older ones and doing uh, the new one today uh, starting a new puzzle with uh, crumbling the puzzle of course uh, there are always things that not crumble Yes, I love the nice pieces and the cardboard puzzle. <laughs> I mean, a puzzle is a puzzle. It's a puzzle every time. It's a puzzle. <laughs> I just don't know how to approach this time. I don't want to do sorting, so I really have to spread it out and lay it out and see how it goes.
So it's a mess. <laughs> what do you think? Um, I was a little bit worried that with this puzzle, um, uh, that it didn't go that well like the last puzzle with this chaos puzzling style. Of course, you don't can um, collect a big pile of puzzles out and making this this one one section and I got many pieces in so that's a so uh, less big thing puzzle so you can sort here you can sort there you can sort here and I think I get a little bit distracted because I don't know how to sort pieces or what I what I want to do in the first uh, I knew the golden grid bridge is always in the left corner is always nice and I knew the the pyramid and the um, sand style thing is in the middle. It's always a, a little bit bigger. That's a nice thing. I remember it from the last build. And also um, the Shifa tomb from Pisa was a distinct pattern and I knew that. Uh, so um, I sought them initially out. But then was the thing of what should I sort? I think the Eiffel Tower, but the Eiffel Tower I have one or two pieces at the end when I'm sorting the first time and then think oh I don't have to see so but it was so dense so I couldn't sort by swapping them up uh, or turning everything upside down really intense so I have sort here pile here pile here pile here pile and doing something of this and that but there are two less pieces sorting out that's so that was so f the table was so full of pieces that I really thought that was a wrong decision to make this in chaos puzzling style because I don't find anything and I don't want I, and I always want to 
and I always was like, where should I find this piece? Should I concentrate more on this? Should I concentrate more on this? Should I concentrate more on this? And it, it is like the puzzle have so many things on it. So the timer hull was one, the puppets, the, the uh, Russian church, the Golden Gate Bridge, the in the middle, the pyramids with the camels um, and the sand ground and then I've always been thinking oh I want to do the Chinese one so I try to sort the green but then I think oh the greens are also there and then I build a corner here and uh, how do, it, do I do the edge and when and it was always uh, coming here and coming there and coming here and coming there but when I got many pieces in or having the framing or then having the edge and then many little little sections get get coming together and connecting to each other and then it would then, then change then then there was a changing point where I think oh that's easy I always find pieces I can sort a little bit and make a little section and the puzzle get filled in and the next little bin and the puzzle fit in <laughs> and then I'm filling up the corners and doing this little sorting here and there in in the box because I knew the pieces I need more than this one or two pieces and then I have the pieces away off the table and so I can handle that a little bit better and then it's get better and better and at the end I think that was faster than the last of course the last was a painterly structured puzzle and that was not easy but the Amy Stewart one was a little bit easier <laughs> in the style of puzzle and also you find pieces and you know oh that's maybe in the British or maybe in this and that section and then sorting out all those uh, sky pieces and all the green pieces there are not so many and I could handle with that and then it got together really easily I think <laughs> it was not really an easy puzzle but I think the style was, wasn't that bad to do that because I always have inside all the pieces and I can sort through the pieces and when they then at last get laying out everything flat and I have sort also the pieces on the board and only trying to insert them that was a nice experience I think although I really don't think I'd like this sort of puzzles or this sort of pictures because um really like doing big sections of one color <laughs> i really like skies and such a thing uh but it's nice to do something else in between and it was a good decision to do this amy stewart one it's it's really a, a nice dense looking puzzle and the little, little things always you find something new also the books in the in the bookshelf and that was one good decision I make. I sort all the books out and have all the books and assemble the books and have this dividing things to mix with the books. So, yeah. <laughs> I think that was a fun one. I really like the style. Um, I really like how it comes together. The feeling of I got so fast in. Oh, it was really a nice feeling and a really nice puzzle. So I want to make them short so I want to end the video now. <laughs> I wish you a happy day, uh, evening, morning, midday, lunch, break, breakfast, whenever and wherever you watch the video. And I hope you see each other in part 3 of the series and we see each other then. <laughs> Bye and happy hobby sets.